It takes three things to have a viable ministry. It takes a gift, a calling, and an anointing. The gifts and what? Callings of God are irrevocable. Okay, so the gift is what? Your gift gives you your ability. Your calling gives you your identity. And your anointing gives you your purpose. Now here's where it can get strange. If you have the gift of prophecy and you're getting your identity from the gift of prophecy, how many of you know you have a performance-based identity because your gift is based on what you do instead of who you are? If you are a prophet, it is not what you do. It is who you are. When someone says, stop being a prophet, you can't stop being you. That would be like saying to a woman, please stop being a woman. Or be a man today. I, I, anyway, there's much more to it than that. So, did you get that? And I will say this, that there are three dimensions to a prophet. One is the gift, one is the call, and one is the office. The gift describes the value the prophets are, and all, obviously the fivefold ministry, to the church. They are to be treated as a gift from Jesus himself. The second part, the call. The call as a prophet describes the identity of the one who's called to be a prophet or a prophetess. Being a prophet is first something you are rather than something you do. And number three, the office of a prophet describes the governing responsibility of the prophet. The prophet is a part of the government of God and therefore has responsibility to, to help lead the people. There's a dimension where the prophet receives his this is a dimension where the prophet receives his or her mantle. And we know we're going to have a lot more days. I'm probably going to do like six or eight sessions on this. But let me just say this. Sometimes you are gifted and called before you have the office. Really a bummer when you're called in the wilderness and you come out and tell people, I are a prophet. <laughs> How many of you understand that a prophet by nature is a leader? And he who leads but has no followers just taking a walk. 